Hi guys, I'm Glenn Ward, I'm 28 years old and I'm a senior design engineer in the audio electronics industry. Oh, I'm pretty gay, to be honest. Um, didn't want to leave the show, absolutely loved it, was hoping to win it ultimately, but you know, you've got to take it on the chin. I tell you what, Susie is highly capable. I mean, you only have to look at her background and the things she's done to see that she's a smart cookie. And the only reason that she's getting a lot of stick at the moment is because she's not putting herself forward enough with her ideas and you know, really getting stuck in and getting involved. Um, you know, it, it's been to her detriment. But in the boardroom that I've just come out of, it's shown me that you know she's not to be messed with. She's a pretty tough one. No. <laughs> Sorry. Um, do I prefer older women? Oh, that's a bit of a dodgy question, but um, no, no, no. Uh, I normally stick to in and around my age. <laughs> no, I, t I take every every opportunity and that, that you know that's presented to me. I assess it on the situation. Any opportunity? No, you know what I mean. <laughs> I don't think we do. I think you need to. No, I, basically, I, when I when I meet someone, you know, I don't judge on age or anything like that. If you know you're a good person and I like you, then that's how we go. Then you'll sleep with them. No, <laughs> I'm not that kind of guy. <laughs> Hit replacement. Okay. Well, what we went for was disruption. Obviously, you see you see all the magazines out on the dentist's uh, reception, and you don't really notice anything, everything's quite generic, so we thought, why don't we throw something in there, we'll attract attention. Yes, it was a big risk, yes, we were asking for trouble, but that's the sometimes, they're the things you have to do in business. If I had to pick an older woman out of the two that you've just given me there, I'd have to go with Helen Mirren as the one I'd go for if I had to. Because well, she's a successful, confident woman who's obviously done well for herself and she still looks good for her age. Oh, I can't do this again. <laughs> I've already been dragged through this before. <laughs> Sorry, you're not going to get it out of me again. Bill Gates, James Dyson, Mark Zuckerberg. I think those three are doing pretty well at the moment. Okay, well, James Dyson is definitely an engineer. Oh, we all had our failings in that task. I mean, you could see that, you know, Jim sort of let it down a bit in the, in the negotiation there, but, you know, we all make mistakes and I'm sure he's learned that. Do I think I'm good looking? I don't think I'm particularly good looking. I think I just average one of the, uh, one of the guys, I'd say. You tell me, what do you think? I have no opinion. Go on, do you think I'm good looking? Right, that's it, there you go. I'll, I'll go with what you say then. Um, I don't get mistaken for anyone, but there are a few associations that are linked to me with people. Tell me more. Um, well, my nickname's Rio, because they all think I'm Rio, I look like Rio Ferdinand, that's what my mates have been calling me. That's their opinion. And it seems to be floating around the web that um, me and Max from The Wanted have some sort of resemblance. But I can't completely see it, but that's their opinion. No, I don't think it was bullying. I think she'd agree that it's nasty in that boardroom and you have to, you have to, you know, if someone makes a mistake, if you want to stay in there, you have to highlight that. And it's an unfortunate, but that's how it goes. One of you has to go. If it's either you or me, sorry, I'm have to force for you. Yeah, you do. You don't want, because it, I don't think it's inherent in any of us that you, to be like that. It's just the nature of the show. You have to, you have to fire it out like that. It, it's not an enjoyable experience, that boardroom. I can tell you that, but ultimately it's a means to an end. To be honest, I can't remember. We, we were all sat in there and you're so focused because you're just thinking, what did I do wrong? What did I do right? Uh, did we get that right? How have the other team done? What am I going to say if this happens? What am I gonna... All you're doing is you're thinking to yourself, get this battle plan together because it's going to go off in there in five minutes. <laughs> nah, 
Jim's Jim's a sound guy. He's got this ability, obviously, to get people on side and 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 fend off trouble when it's coming his way. And you know that's a good good powerful thing to have in this show. And he's just using you know what comes naturally to him. Jim, Leon, Tom. Mm, there's a slight swallow there. <laughs> Susan. <laughs> See, now we're wise to that. I don't think we can fall for that one again. Helen. I don't know what these blinks mean. Neither do I either. <laughs> Zoe. Natasha. Melody. Thank you very much. Anytime. <laughs> <laughs>